It's a case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're on to something. What? Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. What does I Hank think we're close about to? This? We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? <sighs> There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. I'll tell you when it's over, pal. Path unlock. I love seeing that little blue square there, mate. Right, come on, Connor. Turn the ship around now. We're gonna find the perp. I fucked it when I went to the strip club and didn't find anything. No, it's not. No, 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 no. I can solve this case. Come on. I just need more time. That was a weird cut, wasn't it? You failed. No, I didn't. No. No. Did I just end Connor? No. Mate. What just happened? What? Oh, no. I really messed up with Connor. Oh, mate, I'm so... Oh, my God. I'm lost for words. I'm, I was just... I, I'll tell you what I was doing. I was sat here now. Casually letting that one play out. Drinking my little Aldi whiskey, mate. 10.99, one litre bottle. Get involved. And now... God. Oh, mate. It's over for Connor. How unsatisfying is that? This is the worst Let's Play ever. At least we can... Let's try and redeem it with Kara. We've protected our... Uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. Alice really well so far. News again. Oh, it's a radio. Oh, no, there she is. being turned over to the authorities. The country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts... <laughs> this is so relevant. This is so relevant right now. Our armed forces have lost two-thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? No. You chose to play that. You having a laugh? What's going on back there, mate? Alice is asleep. Rose is on one. And we're going to do some lonely looking out the window. Connor, though, mate! Oh, shit. I don't... <laughs> I feel like my Jericho path has really messed this one up. Unfortunately, we're still undercover with Kara. We're human to anyone who asks. Let's put the news back on. <laughs> Connor! Oh, I really mugged that one off there. I mean, he didn't die. Well, he did die, didn't he? He was decommissioned. He's in a scrap heap now. Technically, it could have been worse. I mean, we can turn him back on. God damn. That's the first real time that my decisions and my poor gameplay decisions have really come back to bite me on that one, haven't they? A little further on that way... There's a large freighter called Jericho. When oh, you get there, find Marcus. Oh, no. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. <laughs> you deserve to be happy. 
Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Let you know how. Take care of them. I would assume everything's being traced at this point. Come on, girls. Better not hang around. Fortunately, maybe, maybe, we maybe we'll look on the bright side. The fact that Connor was decommissioned has saved Kara and Alice. We'll, we'll have to try and look on the bright side, I think. Right, which way are we headed? It should be heading, right? Headed? It's the American way, isn't it? You American bastards are rubbing off on me. Yes, you are. Now, I was about to say there's going to be about 400 androids on here, but I think most of them died during the fight with the uh, riot squad in the last episode. Oh, that's what we've watched. This is what happens when humanity gets lazy, mate. I ain't judging it. I was as lazy as they can. I'm trying to get money by playing video games, mate. It's about as lazy as it gets. I ain't judging. Well, monsters. Monsters, I wasn't quite as one-sided as that, was it? Android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids. American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. <laughs> all right. According to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have... Been yeah, because it, it's this is a worldwide... Made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that... The it's worldwide. Oh, we have fully kicked on with this. Find a warm place for Alice. This is this this should be this should be the game's title. Detroit Become Human. Let's make sure let's tuck Alice in. Let's play. Let's find a place for Alice to see. Get by the fire, love. Get yourself nice oh. I don't look like a bed, mate. How do you feel? You've got a fever! COVID-19! If she starts coughing, mate, put her down. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol. There's something I have to tell you. Spit it out, mate. Spit it out. We'll have lots of time to oh, Kara, you're killing me, back. man. Just Stay let back. him say it. Just say it! Police. Scream at me, I'm here. Tell me now. God damn it. Right, where do we reckon Marcus is? Drawing up his game plan upstairs, I reckon. Let's go upstairs. <laughs> They're just watching this on repeat. Yeah, he's upstairs, I reckon. There he is, look. He's kind of... Let's just turn the news off and put some happy music on. This is a, it's a joyous time. I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. You did that. Maybe you should stay here a while. Thanks for the offer. But we won't leave now. 
One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. Okay. You said you're with a little girl, right? Oh, Jesus. You know that humans hate us. Not this one, pal. I've tried my I absolute hardest. Time. I killed her daddy. <laughs> she needs me. And I need her. Fair deuce. Can't it's argue with that. Simple as that. Good answer, Marcus, mate. You've got no one like that. You used to have that. Etc. It was the complete opposite. It wasn't a young girl, it was an old man, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Guys, just turn the news. You've seen that you've seen the reports. Have a rest. Uh, where is she to? Who's this? Oh, I can't be asked with reason anymore. <laughs> Literally, like real life, but there ain't no point. Kind of don't get anything from it. You are doing something, though, to be fair. Mate, where's Alice? Or seems to have been ruled out. Where is she? I've lost her. Where did I put her? Yeah, some fireplace, wasn't it? Oh, probably along there. That looks... Yeah, down there, wasn't it? We lost a lot of good men. Oh, she moved. Fair enough. Oh. Um... Do it. Oh no! Is she going through my memories or what? No! You knew from the beginning. I didn't. You just didn't want to see it. Mate, I did not see that. You wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? <laughs> Alice loves you, Kara. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother. I feel like I should have seen that coming. Forgetting who you are. Wait, what? To become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Right. Okay, so she wasn't. She, yeah. She's just another man. That isn't actually Alice as we know her. Is it? Is it? So that's not Alice as we know her. That was that was just one of her models. Alice as we know her is as human as we are. So it's all all right. Everything's going to be okay. Good. Where is she? I've lost Alice. <laughs> Where did I oh, stand there? I guess. That's where we were going before, before I got rudely interrupted by fake Alice. Phallus. Ooh. That's all word for you. Right, come on, real fake Alice. Tell me why! I really should have seen this coming. See, the problem is, is I, was too I was too busy making the Luther Pedo jokes to actually realise what uh, was going on. Is there something wrong? I don't know. You tell me. Did you malfunction? Oh, uh, no. We... Oh, come on. We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. Forever. Forever. Mm. 
Luther's family as well now. All right. Oh, we have gone happy families with this route, or what? We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. A lot worse would have happened, pal. Maybe if you'd have grown a set. What are we supposed to do? Live like cowards just to survive? We just want to be free. That's a crime? It was a peaceful march, and you chose. To it was not a peaceful now, march. Hundreds of humans and androids are dead. You reap what you sow. I'm gonna slap you around the face in a minute, here, kid. You keep complaining. Oh, what boy. have you done exactly, Josh? At least I fought for us. At least if I die, I die free. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Oh, pipe up. Marcus? I need to think. I'll tell you what we're going to do, mate. We're going all guns blazing. And first of all, Josh, mate, you're out. You're out. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. Oh. I convinced him not to do it. But he did to it. Give me the detonator. A dirty ball. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. Keep it. You never know. <laughs> oh, mate. Have to use it. Yes, you do. That's a lie. Come on. He's lying to himself. He wants destruction. That's what he that's he can see it in his eyes. Look at him. Whatever happens to He's a menace, mate. I just want you to know that I I'm glad I met you. She was gonna say love. Don't kiss, mate. We have to get ready. <laughs> I'm actually gay, love, so... I'll go join the others. Oh, yes. You don't want to be getting tied up with her, mate. She's all over the place. And she was a dirty, dirty whore. I'm the end of days, mate. I ain't got time for kissing, love, no relationships. I am the harbinger. What's the word? Har harbinger. Blah, 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 blah. I'm the bringer of death. That one. Marcus stayed alone with his thoughts. Marcus, mate, it's getting heavy. It's getting heavy. What's this? See, we don't... Oh. Public opinion hated on the leader. North is my lover. Resentful of Josh, companion Simon. We can get it all from thingy. See, I'm hated. All androids are hated, isn't it? So, fair play. See you in the next episode, folks.